Think of pizza. Pizza has a platform. My friends Don Norman and Eli Spencer at the University of California, San Diego, said that's the way to think when you think of a large-scale societal platform when they were writing for Fast Company. Pizza is an interesting metaphor because in a pizza, you have the flexibility to play with different parts of the pizza. You can have a base that's round, square, hexagon, you decide. And you can have a filling, which is to your liking, whether you are wedge, non-wedge, whichever way you want to go. And then you can prepare it in different contexts at different times of the day. It's a very flexible way of doing things. Now imagine if you could do something like that in the context of societal development, where our problems are complex, they are diverse, and they are very important that we solve them in the context of the local society. And so if you were to create an infrastructure which would allow people from different walks of life to come together and quote unquote make their own pizza in the context of that societal problem, that would be very interesting. And so what you would end up doing is creating a shared digital infrastructure which is like your pantry with the bases and with the fillings and different kinds of things. And then you would create environments on top of it, physical environments, virtual environments, different kinds of innovation places where people could come together to solve their problems in their context. The reason why it's important to do this is that large-scale social change happens in small steps. Notice what we call as plus one. Slowly, steadily, you solve very relevant, important problems at scale, and all of a sudden, things look very, very different. And so the whole idea of creating cooperation environments is to sit on top of a shared digital infrastructure and create these places where people come together and make their own pizza. Co-creation more than anything else is a mindset. I think it's not just two or three people coming together or organizations coming together and building something. It is also about letting go of control, working together with people, uh, identify what are the expertise and how they can solve the problem. At Eager Foundation, we are invested in solving India's urban governance problems at scale, at a national scale. And we realize unless we work with local solution providers, local policy makers, the problem cannot be solved to the satisfaction of local people. That is why co-creation is very critical for us. It almost creates degrees of freedom in delivering better solutions to the local communities. We work with technology partners like Lakir Foundation, Smart Lou, Versa Labs. We also work with policy people like IDFC Institute, Data Trust, C-STEP to create policy frameworks, co-create policy frameworks to better adoption of technology. I think Sanjay spoke about pizza. Uh, there's a great example from our experience in, in Andhra Pradesh, where as a part of our platform, statewide platform, we had our own dashboards, which we thought were excellent. Uh, but a local vendor knew what kind of you know, tables they want to see, what kind of colors they want to see, who was colorblind, and what kind of color works with them. So they created a, a dashboard using our div, digital infra, and the usage of dashboards went 100 times up because it was a contextual solution. So the beauty of uh, co-creation is that it actually amplifies the impact of the digital infra, the core infra that you've built, by multiple people using that infra to create solutions which work in a local context, and that's extremely powerful. And at scale, you cannot just build one solution, you have to build multiple solutions when there's such a diverse country like India. So we believe co-creation is really critical for us to succeed in our mission.